Hello everyone, it's Canadian Titan, and we're here with some more Battle Rite. To begin with, as we always do, let's open a few chests. Ooh, a rare pose. But it's a duplicate. That's alright. Let's go back. We got this crazy Halloween pumpkin. Ooh, epic weapon. Sure, equip. Any more chests? No more chests? No more chests. What about here? We can claim reward. Um, doesn't look like we have a lot more in terms of chests. That's okay. Let's go ahead and play. Maybe casual. And eh, let's start with this guy. Let's see if we can get a match. So when I'm recording this is still before Halloween, but I probably won't release it until afterwards. So that's why the Halloween pumpkin and stuff like that. Um, as for our, our mount, we should probably go with the dog. I mean, I have it. Let's see, poses, yep, weapons. Uh, I have a non-default one, so let's go with that. Outfits, that's default, that's the one I'm wearing. I really like something like this. I think that's really cool. Oh, I think it might have found us a match. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I still think matchmaking on this game takes a little too long. Nothing? Match? No match. All right, let's keep looking at things while we wait. Oh, interesting. I didn't realize that the level, the character levels give you different rewards. You can see there at level four with this character, I'll get a silver chest. At level six, I'll get a gold chest. That's kind of neat. All right, it looks like going against the AI is a better opportunity for finding a match. It's pretty sad that I can't find a 2v2 or 3v3 match to play. It's going to take me a little bit to get used to the controls again. Oh, I'm down. I think we got this. Uh, 
I wasn't very effective in that round. Hopefully I'll do better next time. Um, one of the difficult things is that it kind of has a little bit of that MOBA control, the uh, Q, E, R, but it also has the uh, WASD movement. So between the two of those, it's actually kind of difficult to get used to the controls. I keep wanting to, you know, move and use my mouse, and then I, I don't know, I just feel like I'm doing too much with one hand sometimes. Trying to be a little bit more careful this match. We got them. Again, I think the uh, Dathrak who I'm playing with is definitely <laughs> putting out a lot more damage. I don't know if I've ever played that character that he's playing. I don't know. Maybe it's a skin that I haven't seen before. I have to remember to use my tractor beam, which is in R, and then F is my ultimate, but I haven't been able to get up. And I keep reading about the shift thing. All of those other attacks just aren't being used at all. But we're not losing. I love the little chicken that he's riding too. It's pretty cool. Fly over, shoot them, disable them, shoot them, missile them. Just put out some damage quickly. Oh. Panic. That's always fun. And got to use my ultimate there for once, which is kind of nice. We had a lot of health left. And I got to be the MVP of the final round. That's always nice. That's an interesting character. I, I don't know if I've seen that one. Dathrak. Oh, apparently Dathrak does not want to play again with me. That's all right. Dathrak, Dathrak. Oh, I think I know why I haven't played that character. Uh, let's see. Oh, it's just because I don't have Dathrak, apparently. Okay. Looks like there's about four characters I just don't have. I only really like to play ranged characters, so I think that is part of the reason why I don't have that character. Or I thought that was why. It's interesting to me that there's potentially champions that I don't have. Ooh, your teammate drops energy when slain. I didn't know that either. That's kind of neat. Uh, let's see. Let's try that. And here we go. One enemy down. Another down. We won. Whew. And I was the MVP. Nice. 
Another trophy to scrap. I'm trying to remember to use all of my abilities, but like I mentioned before, it's uh, difficult. We got one down. I'll take that stun, that's fine. And we got the other one gone. And I have like full health. I think I grabbed some health though. Gwenifer is the MVP. Thumbs down, Gwenifer. I really like the stun on this character. I find it pretty effective. Oh, nice. It didn't even decloak, and Gwenifer got him. That was great. I'll play with Gwenifer again if Gwenifer wants to play. I think I got the Corgi, the, the dog that I ride on, um, because I purchased the game. Oh no, I've left Gwenifer to fight by herself. And we got them. Gwenifer was a little low on health, but we made it. We both survived. And Gwenifer was the MVP. I don't know. I think I I think I did better than Gwenifer on that round, but Gwenifer's probably a heavy uh, damage dealer. Get in there, put shield on, disable. You know, I can kind of control things with my tractor beam. Come on. Control, 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 destroy the one. And we got the other. Uh, 
let's see what else we can do. Brum, brum, brum. Go, doggy, go. Get that. Oops. I was trying to get that early shield up, and I really just kind of stumbled over my stuff. Oh, well. Oh, gone. Back. Oh, who am I? Use my tractor beam. It's my stun. My ultimate. Oh, I'm petrified. I can't finish with my ultimate, but we still won. And I was MVP of the round, yay! And there goes Wennifer. Oh, nope. Gwennifer's still there, apparently. It's always nice when you find someone to play with. Then you don't have to wait in the matchmaking queues as long. I should probably figure out a way to reduce the matchmaking queues on PvP. I would love to play PvP. <laughs> Jump! Shoot! Survive! And we got them. Look at that support thing that that character has. Just giving me health and stuff, keeping me alive. That's great. Doo -doo -doo. Run against the wall. I love the jump move that this character has. And the high damage stuns. Come on. Dang it. Missed again. Let's get back in this battle. And we got them with seven seconds to spare. <laughs> Winifer's MVP. Maybe that character can just put out more damage. Round three, three. Two, one, fight. Nope. So one of the things about this character's abilities is they're actually a lot faster to resolve, like to actually happen than the previous character I was playing. So sometimes I'm shooting and I'm aiming where I think the player, like the AI is going to be, but by then he's already moved because um, 
yeah, I'm like trying to guess where the AI is going to be rather than being able to just, you know, shoot. So this character is so much more responsive. Oh, wow. Look at the score difference. All that protection, all those disables, that's great. Is Gwenifer done? This guy could be fun. Try Taya. All right, I'll try Taya out. Make sure to be nice to other players. Let's see. I think I'll start with survivability. Go. So I gotta remember I don't have a jump this time. That is going to take some getting used to. Oh my goodness. I was pretty useless. Man, brutal, brutal. All right, well, we'll keep trying. We're the tryhards. The Canadian apologetic tryhards. My goodness, I'm useless with this character. Look at me. Well, I moved around the map and I stayed alive, so at least there's that. Let's see.
All right. I felt a little bit better in that round. My goodness. Gwenifer was definitely still the MVP. Deservingly so. Phew. I did less damage. I did less disables. I did less everything. I just... Oof. I like this little fire guy. <laughs> Spin right round, baby, right round. 20,000 token skin, eh? I haven't even looked at what these tokens do. Yeah, with uh, Esmo, you have the book abilities, and I find them a little bit difficult because instead of attacking from your character, you're also attacking from this little book that he has with him. I mean, it's probably a very powerful character when used in the right hands. But with this little guy, Ashka, I can do fire damage. And I'm. All comes from me, pretty much. So it's a lot easier. All right. I feel like I'll be a little bit more useful in this one. You can use his, uh, his abilities as both attack and defense, which is kind of neat. Oh, I was going to kill him, but my abilities were a little slow. <laughs> Oh, look at that. That's rare. I must have done so much damage compared to um, to Gwenifer. Oh man, that right click ability is just so slow to be used. Look at how little he is. I love how they tease with the uh, energy balls right there, and then when the wall goes down, it's gone.
Whew. We won. It was a little closer, I think, than Gwenifer would have wanted. I think Gwenifer was down at the end there, and it was just me. Yeah, I was able to put out some serious damage, but I don't do any protection or disables, so there's not a lot I can do there. I don't think I have any other things available. So yeah. Oh, looks like Gwenifer's changing it up. That's kind of neat. I think we can make this work. Two heavy damage dealers. I now know that um, she won't have as many stuns and stuff, so I'll have to be a little bit more careful too, because uh, she was throwing down a lot of health for me in some of the previous matches. I like this one. This one's going to do the thing. Bong. Oh, I'm waiting for Gwen. There we go. I love that. And then it pulls us over to the match. And we go. <laughs> I ultimated, but it was too late. We had already won. Let's see. I like damage. I guess it doesn't do it every time. I think it does it just on the first round, which is kind of a bummer. I would love to be back out there and have it like push us back into the map. One enemy down. And we got the other one. Good stuff. Oh, I'm down. Oh, 
I think we won. <laughs> well, I think I think Gwenifer's definitely been playing against AIs for a while, which is really cool. I didn't even do anywhere near as much damage. Oh well. That was good though. All right, I've added Gwenifer as one of my contacts and hopefully we will play with her again. And this is, I mean, this is why I really enjoy games is, is being able to meet people, play with different people around the world. I have no idea where Gwenifer is. That's, I think that's just so great. Um, and remember everyone, gaming should be fun. So keep having fun and thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.